Hey guys, it's Matt coming at you from Farm for All and this past year has been a mess. I don't want to go into all the details in this video, but I'm hoping that as the season progresses I'll be able to get back into the swing of making videos. And although a lot of the videos that I'm trying to make are multi-month projects that require several rounds of filming, I've got something today that I know I can bang out and uh, show you what I'm working on. So I came out this morning and found these little holes where something has been digging in my pea bed. We've got these trellises here, kind of a tight spacing, but that's how much of the bed I have prepared. And uh, yeah, let me get in here and dig. I'll show you what I've got going on in here. I don't know about you, I'm a compulsive digger. I like to find things that haven't germinated yet and see how they're coming along. So, I don't know if you can see this little pea here. Focus. See the little root coming out so yeah something's been going through and digging my peas out I don't know if it's a bird maybe a vole or something and doing a couple of things to try to stop them from getting any more let me show you what that is so we had a friend that had to cut down a cherry tree. He was forced to cut it down by the city because it was going too close to the street or the power lines or whatever the issue was. So we ended up with all of these trimmings. Grab a bucket here and fill it up. And then we'll head back over to the peas. All right, so I'm just kind of Tossing these sticks on there as a cover. And the idea is that any little rooster talkative as always. Um, so the idea is that things won't be able to root around in there to pull my seeds out, but there's enough spacing. There's enough spacing in here that piece will be able to grow up through all of this and that's that's the first part of my solution the other part so I've gone through and applied a little bit of urine across all of these rows and urine's great as a fertilizer but it is also really great as a deterrent for herbivores. I had a friend uh, tell me a story about a few all-female camping trips and what, what they discovered is that women are a little uh, too neat with their bathroom practices and they ended up having mice completely take over their campsite because there wasn't a territory marked out that the mice were trying to avoid. So urine is great deterrent and hopefully these sticks prove to be a good physical barrier. Alright guys that's all I've got for this video. I'll try to sneak in an update as the peas start coming up to show how it's working out. But uh, yeah, hopefully that keeps out whatever's been eating my peas and I'll end up getting a good crop this year.